Hi, I'm Dr. Jeremy Pettis, and a question that I commonly get from patients, especially when they're first diagnosed with type 1 diabetes, is what is type 1 diabetes? And what it is, is it's an autoimmune disease. And autoimmune diseases make up a whole family of diseases that people are, are familiar with, like rheumatoid arthritis or inflammatory bowel disease, like Crohn's disease, these kinds of things. And in an autoimmune disease, the body, for whatever reason, identifies something inside the body as foreign that it normally shouldn't. So specific to type 1 diabetes, there's cells in the pancreas called the beta cells that make insulin. And in type 1 diabetes, the immune system kind of goes awry and identifies the beta cells as foreign. It thinks it might be a virus or something, and it attacks and kills the beta cells that make insulin. And as a result, over time, as these beta cells are destroyed, people cannot, can no longer make insulin, and they're required to take insulin injections to keep their blood sugars in a normal range. So in a nutshell, it's essentially the immune system going awry for reasons we don't really know that ultimately require people to take insulin because their body can no longer produce it. And for more information, please go to our website at tcoyd.org. Thank you.